Well, today's a special day. Uh, we have Brandon uh, Cutler coming here. Uh, he thinks he's just showing us our next outfit that his wife made us for Double or Nothing. He thinks that he's going to do voiceovers for the Battle Royal. And there are yeah. no voiceovers for the Battle no, Royal. We, we've, uh, we've been brewing up something with Tony. Uh, the three of us have seen Brandon work his ass off the last year and a half, two years on the independent scene, and he's never asked for a favor, never, ne never asked for anything. He works harder than anybody I've ever met. He's, he was out of business for seven years, and he's, and he's back now. And you know what, if we, anybody deserves a break, it's him. We know he's been struggling financially, so th this is going to help here, him out. And, he's here. Yeah, he's here. Let's do it. And just to so read the first one, and then like kind of take a beat between the two. Okay. Go ahead. My name is Brandon Cutler and I'm a participant in the Casino Battle Royale. I'm Brandon Cutler, and after I win the Casino Battle Royal, I'm getting a shot at the future AEW World Champion. My name is Brandon Cutler. I took a seven year, wait, let me read this one. <laughs> yeah, we can't use that one. <laughs> you gotta read it out loud so you can hear it. Okay, uh, you start over again? Yeah, from the top. Okay. My name is Brandon Cutler, and I am a participant in the Casino Battle Royale. I'm Brandon Cutler, and after I win the Casino Battle Royale, I'm getting a shot at the future AEW World Champion. My name is Brandon Cutler. I took a seven-year long break from wrestling, but now I'm back. I work hard. I never complain. I've never once asked for a favor. I deserve a break. So... The next thing I'm going to do is sign this contract that Matt and Nick are about to offer me. <laughs> <laughs> I did not yeah. read that part. Yeah, this is real. Yep, we got a contract right here for AEW. <laughs> Congrats. <laughs> That's it, baby. Congrats. <laughs> you deserve it. See that coming? <laughs> <laughs> um, Matt and Nick just offered me a, a full job like with a contract and everything. Yeah, uh, as a wrestler and also as a executive content producer. Oh wow! What, and, what does that entail? <laughs> pretty much what I've been doing for being the elite with them. Just to... <laughs> and it starts now. So we don't gotta wait. <laughs> and so I got the two contracts. I'll be bringing. I'll be bringing those home. So you're going to be a competitor in the Casino Battle Royale, aren't you? I saw the graphic. Mm -hmm. He's booked, Matt. Yeah. Do you even understand the ramifications of this thing, Jungle Boy? Can you even get into a casino? That's where the show's located. Are you even old enough, Jungle Boy, huh? Are you sure? You think you're better than me, huh? Yeah. Are you insulting me? Not Do you talking? even understand what Matt is saying to you, huh? Yeah, yeah. It looks like you have a lot of pressure on your damn shoulders. Are you strong enough? Are you tough enough? Okay. Well, pick a damn card. Then pick a card. Any card. Just keep it a secret, okay? And you. You, you want a shot, huh? Yeah. You want a, hey, you want a hey, casino hey, battle royale? No, huh? hey, we're, what's up? We're fully booked. You can't just... It's, okay. it's fine. Just everyone. We'll cut Michael Elgin or something. Huh, big guy? What do you say? You want to be in the casino battle royal, huh? You want a shot at this? Yeah. Then pick a card. Are you sure? Pick a card. Okay. Any card. There you go. All right. Good luck, boys. We'll see you in Vegas.
Hey, no peeking. You, you can talk? Yeah, man, I got a master's degree. What's your excuse? Raulio, Legion Hotel Libre went great last night. This is a great meal that we just had, but I've got one more thing I have to do. I need to do a worst town bit in Santiago, Chile. Can you help me? Can you do it? No te entiendo nada. No English? No English. Man. Mi español es, es, es terrible. Mi español es basura. Tu quiero cambio BTE inglés para español? Imposible. Imposible. Español es difícil. Ay, ay, ay. Man, I gotta stop taking these single bookings. Thanks anyway, bud. Hey, you want your Sammy match? Sammy Guevara. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, I don't know. Like, he, he's always talking shit about me in the vlog. Hey, guys! Ooh, what's up? What's up, up baby? Fuego del Sol. Fuego del Sol. I, it's been a long time, bro. It has, man. But Dude, your match? Ooh. Did you watch it? Ah, I'll be honest. I didn't watch it, but I heard it, and it sounded oh, you bigger. You heard it. Dude, it hurt. It Heard it awesome. And I'm kind of tired of it, Sammy. What? I'm, I, I think what everybody's been saying about you is true. Maybe you are the shit of the earth. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you mean? I mean, you've always talked crap about me in vlogs. Mm -hmm. Like, we go back way you back. You mean the now. Sammy Guevara vlogs on YouTube? Yeah, yeah. yeah YouTube.com? Yeah, yeah you, talk, you talk about my vlogs badly on Fuego del Sol's channel. Like, okay, look, Fuego, maybe I've been a dick. And maybe some of the people. Maybe they're right. Maybe maybe I have been a dick in the past and not sincere. But you know what? I'm sorry. I'm trying, you know? I just have a lot going on with AEW and everything, you know? But again, your match sounded great. And I do mean that. I, I do appreciate the sincere part. No problem. Well, I got to go get ready for my match. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you again. Good to see y'all. I should have walked away 10 seconds ago, but I'm gonna walk away now. It's all good. good to see y'all. You know, maybe maybe that Sammy G guy, maybe he's not that bad. He's all right. Himself, Dustin Rhodes. See, Cody's got a much bigger heart than I do. He doesn't have what it takes to put him down, but that's why I'm gonna do my best friend a solid. This old son of a bitch dies tonight. Oh shit! I can't let down! Get down! Down! Can you see us? Can you see? Shit, is he looking at us? Alright, no, he turned around. Okay. Alright, look at me. Be quiet. Do you understand me? Nod if you understand me. Alright, dipshit. It's go time.
MJF. What? Right? What? You look like MJF. N nope. That is... I do not know who that is. That is a foreign name to me. I'm sorry, buddy. The Zelda competition's right down the, the street. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, the, the Zelda competition. Of Zelda that is why yeah, I'm here. Yeah. yeah. By the way, huge fan, sir. Huge fan. Right, Pleasure to meet careful you. careful with that sword. Oh, Jeez, I know. Sorry about that, man. Eye. Yeah, I, I just I tripped. Life. You're absolutely right. You're All absolutely right. right. Hey, man, you uh, keep keep doing your thing, you man. You look like MJF. Don't, don't know who that is. Keep, come here. Where are you going? Get off of here. Come on. BT email bag, where the cast might just answer all your questions. My question for the week for the uh, BT mail bag is how many championships will AEW have? Uh, we're going to try to keep it simple. We, uh, we don't want the titles to uh, lose prestige, and that, that usually happens when you have way too many championship uh, belts. So we're going to have probably just a few. Uh, we want it to be very important when we have a title change and things like that. So. so my question this week comes from Jeremy Ivins, who asks, besides your match at Double or Nothing, what part of the show makes you the most nervous? Well, I'll tell you the truth. The part that always makes me the most nervous is never the match, and it's never anyone else's match. It's the technical stuff, the stuff that I don't understand. I'm most worried about blackouts. I'm most worried about someone else's music being hit, um, the, the wrong name being used for an entrance video, stuff like that. Technical miscues that, that I would never be able to fix if they, they indeed happened. That's the part that I'm nervous for, um, but we've got a good crew, so really it's helping to put my mind at ease. I'm hoping that none of that happens at Double or Nothing, but if it does, it'll probably be funny, so enjoy. Welcome to BTE Mailbag. Most recently, Riot Zoo asked, Will AEW do a pay-per-view in the United Kingdom? And his other question was, will ITV air weekly shows for AEW? So, for the former, for that first part, AEW, UK, pay-per-view, considering the most recent events, I'd say yes. And I'd say, hell, we were already planning on it. And of course, we're gonna host an actual pay-per-view in the United Kingdom, spoiler. As far as the weekly shows, you'll have to ask the kind folks at ITV. Can you tell I'm winking? Oh my God, we're at an airport. We haven't been in an airport in it's four been, months. No, it's been about two months, realistically. Yeah. Mexico was our last time. That's right, it's been a while though. So it feels like probably an eternity to us, but. You know what, I'm just gonna be upfront about <laughs> wh where we're headed. <laughs> it's too cool. We got, we got, this is, this is uh, Matt Jackson with us as well. I wonder what that means. Yeah, we're, we're heading to New York City for the for the TNT upfronts by the time this episode comes out. We've I think the world been, will know, right? We've been spotted by fans, so <laughs> hopefully spoilers don't get out. We've been sitting we've on this. We've seen the chatter online. We've been sitting on this for a very long time. Yep. And it's so exciting that uh, the world will finally know soon. away changing wrestling yeah. yeah we're about to Are you uh, sure is that what we're doing i think so okay try about to uh make the big announcement that we're gonna have a television show on tnt on network uh, i mean on you know what was the word that we used earlier prime time, prime time. so all the fans who said we were a t-shirt company they, they were right yeah, we're prime time t-shirt company <laughs> prime time t-shirt company <laughs> this is there a way to say we that we just went live we're back in the wrestling business baby fire feels good we missed the initial part <laughs> that was yeah, we did. cody was too busy tying my tie <laughs> we missed pretty much all of it, Here, we'll it. Take okay. it. Yeah. i think it looks good though I'm gonna do it right damn now what an right unbelievable now. feeling yeah, huh we're back really good you, wrestling's it. back on tnt rolling. we've been hiding this for <laughs> i'm as excited a long I time we're here on our very first red carpet premiere on bte it's actually a blue carpet it's an exciting time we just announced that pro wrestling is coming back to tnt 
it's just, it's huge. We've been sitting on this news for a very long time. I don't even, this feels surreal. It's oh, yeah. Unbelievable. I can already feel the buzz. The wrestling world has changed right now, so get ready. We're going to be on prime time, baby. Consular Affairs, that is not me, that's the wrong address. And it says Hanky. What is this? Hi. Hangman, it's your best friend, Cody. I know we're really close to double or nothing, and I thought right now is the perfect time to tell you. It's, it's, con it's confession time, okay? I wish I could have you promise you're not gonna hate me after what I tell you, but the truth is, the Road to Double or Nothing crew, we're the ones who set up the surveillance cameras. The whole thing was, was Nick and Matt and, and me. I mean, I mean, you haven't cheated on your diet. You didn't, you didn't need the secret stuff. Matt and Nick were the ones who sent that to you. Come on, man. I mean, maybe I was just feeling inadequate myself. I mean, look at the latest edition of, of Muscle and Fitness. Look who's in it. That's my wife. And this is on shelves right now. Maybe I just was jealous of the fact that she got in Muscle and Fitness in this month's edition, which is on shelves now before I did. But I don't want to make this about me. I'm not making this about me. You were full gear ready. The secret stuff, you had it all along. You did the work, do the work, which is, you know, consequently my expression, very popular expression, can't trademark it, people, it inspires people, but I don't wanna make this about me. Look at my shirt. Look at that shirt. What animal is that, hey man? What animal is that? Huh? Huh? It's a fucking horse! Because you're a horse! Now you go out there and you you kick Pac's ass. You didn't need the secret stuff. You had it all along. You kick his ass, hey man. Do the work.
Hey, did you like that video? Click the screen for more. And where do you think you're going? Before you check out our official merchandise page found at ProWrestlingTees.com slash YoungBucks. And to support the entire cast, you can visit ProWrestlingTees.com slash AEW. And thanks so much for being the elite. The elite. The, the elite. What, Nick, you're not going to sing it all with me this time? <laughs>